Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Spin Tires Blind. We are making our way through the map, uncovering these uh, cloaked things. Uh, we've pretty much banged up our poor uh, little 4x4 over here quite a bit already. You can see the front part is a little <laughs> smashed up. The back part was completely smashed up, but we actually fixed it up. Um, and pretty much uh, used up all the fixing points we had with this trunk up here. <laughs> So we do have to take it a little bit more careful. We need to go that way, which is, let's see, it's south, southeast. Okay, so we need to go south, southeast. Aw, oh, damn, I wanted to stay on the tarmac. Oh, there's a truck over there. Can we use that one? Probably. Yeah, I can't just keep pedal to the metal over all the bumps and everything. I have to be a little more gentle. But look how brilliant all this looks. Ah, we can unlock this one. Excellent, and it's got fuel. And what is... What else is this? Wait. Oh, yeah, we're... Oh, yeah, we're over here. Okay. What is this? Is this some kind of a... It's just a lodge. Well, we can get some fuel over here, so that's alright. So now, we can go to advanced. Change truck. Click on this one. There we go. We now have this vehicle. We can also go to advanced. We've got a fuel cistern here. How do we actually change what it has? I thought you could do that. Oh yeah, you can do that at garages. Okay, so let's do this. Let's uh, fill up 13 liters. That's all right. And change the truck to back to this one. It was The engine is still running. Right, so yeah, still need to go east, south, east. Is there a road back there? No. So let's go. Oh, diff lock is on. Don't need that right now. Um... Should we go here? It's probably gonna be a really bad idea, but I need to go. <laughs> right, let's go. This is the whole point of spin tires. Going off-road like crazy. I'm gonna take it easy, though. I don't want to smash into something. Oh, look, mushrooms. There's water over here, which means mud! Whoa! Do you see the tires getting cleaned up by water? I mean, it's brilliant, all these little details. Let's uh, turn off diff lock and all-wheel drive. It's the only way we're... Ouch! We're gonna... Oh, 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 oh. We're gonna get through this. Oh. I think I've damaged it a little more. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh I shouldn't have gone there. Damn. We're gonna get stuck. Careful, careful, careful. And it's, uh, it's dusk now, I think. Careful! Okay, I think I'm going the right way. Yes, I am. But how the hell am I gonna get out of here? I have no idea. Careful. Yeah, if you have a steering wheel and pedals, I think you will really benefit from this. In fact, I could use a joystick with this so I could have more uh, analog ap application of uh, throttle, for example. I think that would really benefit me. Oh, crap. How the hell... Are we stuck on that? Darn it. Okay, well... I can still winch myself out, so that's alright. What's going on with the engine? There we go. That's enough for me. Is the engine... I think I must have damaged the engine a little bit. <gasps> oh, crap! This rock was the problem, and I think I must have broken something. Hold on. Can I repair this? Let's hope I repaired a little bit. Okay, start engine. Okay. Careful. Yeah, I'm... <laughs> that rock must have done a lot of damage to the underside. Even though it should have some kind of protection. Alright, excellent. So that's another cloak removed. Now we have to go back. Oh, there's another one over there. I didn't see that. Well, let's go... North. Yep, north. I have to go north. So now we can uh, turn on the lights as well. Are we gonna get through that? That's a lot of rocks. 
We'll have to be careful. This must be so much fun in multiplayer as well. I gotta, I gotta do that. I gotta find someone. Oh, 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 careful. Yeah, with a pedal, with pedals, this would be much easier because you could apply, like, a third of the throttle instead of full or nothing. Oh, that's, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Sorry about that. Sorry. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> I'm driving over everything. Oh, there's a big rock there. Oh, those are big rocks. Look at that. If I turn off the lights... Oh, it actually looks pretty cool. Ah, because they still have these lights up here. The floodlights. Alright, let's be careful over this. Now we're really in the wilderness. I mean, there's not even a dirt road over here. Whoopsie daisy. Let's go. How the hell am I gonna get through this? Why, why the heck did I not go back to the road? <laughs> oh no, I'm so in trouble. Ah, I can see the road over there. I could turn off the diff lock, probably. But I don't really wanna... Will I hit the branches as well? I will indeed. That's pretty cool. Alright, there we go. There we go. Diff lock off, all wheel off. Oh, oh, we've unlocked that one. Yeah. That, I believe, is a Maz. M-A-Z. And it's actually got a tank engine in. Stop the engine. Change truck. There it is. Refuel with add-ons or tow to fuel sto a station to garage. Ah, oh, it's got no fuel. But I've got that truck over there, which I can use to fuel. Uh, tractor. Oh, yeah, it's got this tractor. So let's change the truck back to that one. Repair. With what? Oh. I guess this little thing over here has the repair. Oh, that's nice. So now... I guess I could take that thing. But it would be useful, more useful for uh, towing this stuff. I would have to get it back to the garage, of course. There's fuel over there. Let's, uh, yeah, let's get back over here. Back over here to that other truck. So we can refuel the big one. There it is. Nice. Careful. Alright. Stop it here. And of course, stop the engine. Change truck. That one. Start your engines. Look at the... Oh, look at the tires over here being deformed. That is so brilliant. It's only got all wheels. Does it have anything else? No, it's also got diff lock. Okay, that's good. Uh, no, I don't want diff lock right now. Oh, that's cool. That is very cool. Uh, it's that way. Yeah, it's that way. It's got 350 liters tank. Only for itself. This one is a thousand, I believe, so that's pretty awesome. Now, this is a beast. This one. Right here. We're gonna refuel it. Uh, fuel. <laughs> Can't even refuel it fully. Right. Uh, let's get out of the way, maybe. You can actually hear the transmission in reverse. It's brilliant. Alright, let's go that way and leave it here for now. There we go. Alright, now this one, this beast. I should probably bring it back to the garage and equip it with uh, stuff that will uh, allow me to carry wood. Because there's a lumber mill. So I think I should do that. I should follow the tarmac back over here. Yeah, just like that. I think there's mostly tarmac. Over here it looks like... Uh, uh, 
it looks uh, might be tarmac as well mostly 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 at night right now let's start the engine on this beast <laughs> oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah right let's uh, put it in reverse there we go Look at that thing. Oh my god. What a beast. Let's go. <laughs> oh, it's a bastard to turn though. That reverse. There we go. I kind of miss the guy going bleh inside. No? No, in the tech demo, you had a guy inside, and whenever you uh, toggled um, uh, the diff lock, somebody was, you know, trying to pull the the lever and going. Suka. <laughs> Apologies to any Russian viewers. I know that those were curses for people who understand Russian. Come on, come on. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. See. The wheels that have the least resistance are spinning, but if I turn off um, diff lock, for example, without all wheel, there we go. Both, uh, all the back four are turning at the same rate. If I turn off all wheel drive, uh, the front ones would uh, go as well. Right, now, we're going back here. Yep, that's the right way. Now, yeah. Actually, I will put it into, what is one plus? Let's see. Is that for more speed? Oh yeah, it is. Yeah. No? Oh no, it's it's just the first gear but with uh, with a higher first gear. That's what it's one plus. This automatic is for speed though. Look at this thing. We're plowing across tarmac and it's still using 15 liters a minute. It's bloody guzzling that fuel I love the feel of it I mean all the you know the, the bouncing the, the, the physics everything we could go for that cloaking over there I wonder if we should and I don't seem to have unlimited fuel I mean even at the garages do you see all the um, all those uh, leaf um, oh, I forgot the words, I apologize. These leaf uh, springs, yeah, leaf springs working. Oh, so we're going kind of the right way. Hmm. So let's go that way until the, uh... Until the road turns, which is now. And go left if we can. Hmm. Yeah, we might be able to do that. And just get that cloaking thingy. I don't want cloaking thingies on my porch. Oh, um, not sure this is gonna go anywhere. But it's right there. 23 liters per minute, yeah. Right, we will require all wheel lock and diff lock. 37 liters, 38, bloody hell. Move closer to remove cloaking, there we go. It is there. Bloody hell, we're just plowing through everything. There it is. Cloaking removed. Let's get back. Actually, I'm just gonna go in reverse. Just gonna keep going in reverse instead of trying to turn here, because that's gonna be bloody impossible. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. What? This thing is plowing through everything. Careful. There we go. Turn diff lock and all wheel drive off. Alright. And let's go. Brilliant. Oh, that's a bridge. Oh, that looks cool. I gotta be careful here. I don't wanna fall in. Also, I don't know if they've got uh, bridge physics, so I don't want to just blow through it like crazy. 
Yeah, who needs road markings? We just drive over everything. Uh, oh no, that's not going the way I want. No. Damn it. Well, we might as well get that other cloaking thing. Where is it? Uh, it is north. It's kind of the opposite of where we're going. Alright, let's go reverse. Yet. <laughs> Go. We're probably gonna need this here. Diff lock. There we go. There we go. Yeah, this thing does not like to turn very much. Diff lock off. And let's go. All these sounds, the creaking, the the engine, the turbine, it's brilliant. Come on. There we go. Lots of mud on the tires. Look at the size of those tires. It's bloody crazy. No, don't want to go in the mud. I want to go over here. So we go north. Oh, there's a lumber mill here. I will require... Oh, maybe not. I'll just keep going. Look at all that mud. <laughs> is that a lumber mill? I'm not sure what it is. Doesn't seem to be. And how do we get to that thing? I don't think we can really get through this here, because there's a lot of stumps here. Oh, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? Sorry. Oh, there's a road right there. Excellent. One damage, one damage. There we go. Yeah! Where's the cloaking now? It's right there. But I don't see it. Oh. Uh, it's to my right. Oh, there it is. Oops, I had the parking brake on. It's probably not what you want when you're trying to uh, put as much power to the wheels as possible. <laughs> it's a nice... Uh, I think that's the ocean, actually. Don't really want to go into the ocean. That's for sure. Let's go. There's a lot of mud here, so I'm gonna just keep the diff lock and all-wheel drive on. There we go. There we go. Now we can get back. Yeah, this thing is a lumbering giant. It goes through everything, but it also turns like a giant. Rightfully so. I've already used up about a sixth of the fuel <laughs> in these few minutes that I'm driving, it's crazy. Alright, do I really need diff lock and all-wheel drive? I don't think so over here. Probably gonna get proven wrong right away, but... Uh, yeah, I'm already... Oh, no, it's going. It's going alright. Yeah, would it be cool if you could uh, have the cockpit view as well? I think they said they would do that. Right, there's the... Uh, there's the tarmac. I want to get back to. Lots of big uh, stones over here, or rocks, that I don't want to really drive over. East. That is where I want to go, indeed. Alright, so that... Goes back here. Okay, I need to go over here. Let's go! Yeah! Oh, this bridge again. Gotta be careful. Don't want to drive through. Power! This game is so much fun to play. It really gives you the feeling that you're driving something massive. <coughs> Excuse me. Something massive that, uh, you know, gets stuck in mud. And believe it or not, despite the quite pretty graphics and very nicely done models, all the physics and everything, this game is only, what, a five, 550 uh, megabytes large? I think that's it. It's pretty amazing. I wish you could have sort of a minimap as well. Uh, I believe I need to go left over there, by the lights. 
So let's go over here and then left. It's a very small road, even though it leads to tarmac. What the hell? Oh no, I went past it already. Uh -huh. Oh well. Well, we shall continue next time. When you try to get back to the garage. And, um, yeah. We'll do something uh, with this truck then. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.